At CES in Las Vegas, BlackBerry unveiled a prototype of an autonomous driving Ford Lincoln MKZ that runs on the same software as its smartphones. You know, the phones that have never been hacked, and we're bringing all the expertise and the skill set from those security people into the automotive space. BlackBerry's QNX software operates the GPS and obstacle sensing LiDAR and other sensors that operate the car. QNX is you know, one of the growth engines for the company moving forwards, and we're investing very heavily in developing a lot of more advanced capabilities in uh, thermostats. This year's CES features connected devices for the so-called Internet of Things, increasing concerns about security. Hackers in October were able to launch a cyber attack through unsecured Internet connected devices such as web cameras. So people have to be aware and whenever they purchase any products, they have to make sure they purchase products who are secure and they don't have any access to the internet to anybody that they want. Many of the companies at CES say security is a top priority and they use secure cloud networks such as those operated or used by Amazon and Apple. Apple's HomeKit came first to mind um, because of the encryption. I got out of bed, that's the red, for a few minutes. Sleep Numbers 360 Smart Bed is designed to make adjustments through the night to help users sleep better. Personal identifiable information is kept separate from your sleep data so even if you know someone found something it's it's not even juicy Alexa turn on all the lights common household items okay ranging from door locks to light bulbs are being outfitted with microchips Amazon, out. hackers only hack things or exploit things where they can achieve some goal uh, and there are very limited goals in hacking light bulbs as far as I can see but it has caught the attention of the Consumer Technology Association, which runs CES. I think there'll be a growing consumer trend to demand some level of certification or security, and we're looking at that as an industry. For now, the concerns are creating new opportunities for some companies to focus on making devices and cars safe from hackers. Peter Banda, Associated Press, Las Vegas.